So let me show you how to build an AI agent with no code in about 30 seconds. So the first thing you have to do is you have to go to the browser n8n.io. You should log in and create a new workflow. And this would look something like this, where you have to add a new step. So we start with clicking on this new first step and we can go to on chat message. When we have set this one up, we have to select the AI agent. So if you click on the plus side and go to advanced AI, go to AI agent. Then you have the module of the AI agent in your workflow. From here, we keep the things the same for now. What we have to do here is we have to create a chat model or we have to add a chat model. In this case, we will add OpenAI chat model. From here, you have to connect to your OpenAI account with your API key and select the module. So when this is all working, you will see no errors here. From here, we have to add a memory because we have to store some things that we said in the past. So we select the window buffer memory and select the context on five. And this is where the magic happens. So we have to create the tools and this can be anything. For this case, we will do a simple tool like an email. So we go to the plus side and we type in Gmail. So when we have the Gmail tool, we click it on, connect your Google account through this, sign up with Google. Then you can go to this page and actually set it up correctly. So I'll show you what the settings are. So the first thing we want this agent to do is to get my email. And this is all set up correctly now, so we just click it away. And then we add a new tool, which is also the Gmail tool, but one for sending email. So we go to the Gmail tool again, and we go to message, it's the same. We go to send instead of get. So in this, we have to set up some things. So like the to, the subject, and the message. So if you pause this video, and type it over, you have the right settings. So we have set up this simple AI agent now, which can actually get my email and send in reply. So what I do now is go to chat and try it. So what I will do here is ask him to read my last email and to send the reply to this person. So we ask this question to him and we see the actual AI agent running like this. It will receive and get my last email and then send an email back. So it just got my email, now it's sending an email back. Oh, I got an error, so we'd have to look into this. And look at this, I actually got an email back from him.